you soon. Thank you, Caroline. Back to the breaking news we've been following this morning. Right now, Houston police are investigating a deadly shooting in Kingwood. They say a man shot and killed his friend after what they are calling a disturbance. This happened at a home on Ben's Branch near Ben's Town. And KPRC 2's Rilwan Belogan is joining us there with the very latest in this case. Rilwan? Hey, good morning. Neighbors in this area are beginning to come out to try and figure out exactly what happened overnight. Same as investigators as they're walking in and, in and out of the third floor units of this apartment complex where they believe some of this argument started. Now, one witness says he lives next door and heard part of the argument, then the fatal gunshots. Police say they were called in shortly before 4 o'clock this morning at the apartment complex on the 2700 block of Ben's Branch. The victim was declared dead on scene. And the investigating detective says two friends in the complex were arguing over something that became deadly. We know the victim doesn't live on the third floor where the shooting occurred, but another floor, either the first or the second, and he ended up coming up to the third floor. Now, police say at the time they believe all three were together inside the units before the shooting. Next door, a neighbor, Samuel Frazier, says he heard the two people arguing before the gunshot. Yeah, it was right outside my window, so I was like, <laughs> but I rolled over and I just ran out of my room because I was like, I didn't, I don't want to be right there because like he had him like pinned up against the stairs at one point, and that's like right where my bed is. So if you would have like shot him right there, like I don't know, I could have like gone through. Scary situation there, as you can see, forensic investigators still on scene at this hour, along with the detectives here. Now, investigators say they are questioning two people. One, they're believed to be the suspect. Reporting live, Roman Belogan, KPRC 2 News. Alrighty, thank you.